What's up everybody, this is RBD coming at you with my Detroit Lions Madden 13 franchise. This is week 16, I'm playing the Atlanta Falcons, it'll be a fun game. And I uh, hope you look forward to watching it, here's the guys taking it away with the intro. The anticipation is mounting here as both sides get set for this matchup between the Atlanta Falcons and the Detroit Lions here at Ford Field. Hello, friends, and uh, happy holidays. Merry Christmas. Jim Nance and Phil Simms getting set for kickoff, and hope you're having a great holiday season. we got some football coming your way. Yeah, I think we got some exciting football coming your way. Enjoy the holidays and enjoy this game today. This has been an incredible stretch. A seven-game winning streak riding into this one. Well, seven games in a row. I mean, I played 15 years. I think I had two times where we won that many games in a row. It tells you a lot about the football team. They have talent everywhere. The coaches on top of all situations. They're not afraid to gamble in tough, tough spots. They're going to be tough to beat here today, too. All right, here we go, guys. Starting off with the ball, Atlanta Falcons have the ball and a long run on second and four by Michael Turner, and they're pretty much in field goal range already. And uh, it's gonna be a tough game. Atlanta Falcons, are a really good team. I'm pretty much locked in the playoffs, but still want to win the game. But uh, third and fifteen to finally uh, stop them. Two straight times on first and second down. Third and fifteen, they got to convert a long play. And uh, going for the sack and miss it, but then my defensive tackle comes in front of the screen pass, which is really good. They get a field goal out of the drive and in around here. Got the ball back, Calvin Johnson, for about eight yards. Thought it was a neat little play. Wanted to show you guys. Uh, third and three, got to convert, man. Uh, early on, a nice little dump off to Sheffer for Scheffler for the first down, second and ten. I hit Burleson over the middle to about the 40 or about the 38-yard line. So a nice little play, 32 yards. And then on the first and ten, hurt Burleson again to about the 15. And it is now third and four. Got to convert. It's a big play. I mean, I want to try to get a touchdown and get a quick lead. But there is absolutely nobody open. And next play, it's a fourth down and going for a field goal. And honestly, have no clue what just happened and why that happened. But I miss a 30-yard field goal. A gimme field goal I miss. Uh, I don't know what happened, but I missed it and makes me made me pretty mad. But then you got to keep on turning, only down by three points. Julio Jones, a nice 17 yard reception, and on a first down, the play right after that hits Roddy White. I mean, my defender was in perfect coverage. He misses the tackle, and they score a touchdown. I don't know what happened, but that's kind of, kind of plays they make on all Madden, which is really annoying. My ball, second and three, nice little first down to Stovall curl route. Got to give take what the defense gives you. And here's a nice little slant pattern, waiting for it to develop Chad, uh, Calvin Johnson for about 15 yards there. A nice little sweep play to Javi Best, didn't get to run the ball that much this game, but uh, I'm down by 10, trying to do whatever I can to get a touchdown or so. And then you hit, uh, I hit Stovall to about the 13-yard line, so I'm from about the, well now I'm from the 7-yard line on the 3rd and 3. Big play here, I want to try to score a touchdown. And Burleson drops the ball. A bunch of stupid stuff happens this game, and it's so annoying. And I end up getting a field goal anyway, but on a little uh, swing route, hit Michael Turner, and he gets about 500 yards. Third and 17, though, it did sack him twice in a row. It hit him out of knocked him out of field goal range. But what do you know? Michael Turner up the middle, breaking 72 tackles, back into field goal range. So they get the field goal out of that drive. It's 13 to three. And on the uh, following kickoff, Titus Young gets it, and he's bringing it. All the way to the 35 and fumbles the gosh dang ball. So, that's all Madden for you. To about the 20 and eventually on a first and goal here. They're already up by 10 with 42 seconds left. And Matt Ryan will hit a guy in the end zone. Even though my linebacker looked like he was in position to intercept it. And they score a touchdown. So, they're up by 17 points. I'm trying to do whatever I can to get some points before the for the halftime. I hit Stovall to about the 50 yard lines on a nice little out route. And 17 seconds left in the game on a third and two. I hit Calvin Johnson to about the 20-yard line. So I'm in field goal range technically, but not for me really. I'm trying to score a touchdown. I see Titus Young, and for some reason he cut to the inside. If he would have stayed straight, it would have been a touchdown. 
hurry up, but in the NFL, you they don't stop it after first down, so I get absolutely no points out of that drive, which is absolutely bull crap, but it is what it is. I get the ball back after first, the uh, well, at halftime, and Calvin Johnson, a nice play to about the 30-yard line, so I'm in business trying to get some points. I'm down by 17, but there's a half to go, so I can possibly come back, and then I hit... Uh, well, Titus Young drops the ball. He drops the ball so many freaking times, and it's so annoying. So I have to go for it on 4th and 17. Because, I mean, I can't stop them. i got to score points, and I, I, there's nobody open. Just threw it up to Calvin Johnson. They didn't get it. So it's 3rd and 1. A really big play here. And if I stop him, I'm in business. But what do you know? It's all mad. And Michael Turner gets hit in the backfield, but breaks about 72 tackles and gets down. Um, gets the first down, so... Is what it is, and on a play action pass, Matt Ryan to Roddy or Julio Jones, touchdown Falcons. So I'm down 27 to three at this point. It looks like nothing my way, nothing's gonna, nothing's gonna happen my way, and that's the case here. As I throw an interception over the middle, don't know why I threw that pass, but I threw a pick. I was in um, desperation, and they picked the ball off. So I do stop them twice in a row. It's third and 19. And I do get the sack. Averill gets the sack. So it's uh, they have to punt the ball. And on 3rd and 12, I hit a nice little pass uh, after rolling out to uh, Chavez Best. I was, uh, man, I was in per pure desperation there. Nobody was open. I had to roll out, and he came over wide open. But on 3rd and 5, man, after a few little plays, Calvin Johnson. And I thought that was a touchdown, but obviously it wasn't. And that, saved, that killed a bunch of time off the clock. And it ended up me not getting a touchdown because I threw two straight picks. I didn't want to run the ball because I want any time to, uh, I didn't want much time to go down. But on a second and twelve, I did get the field goal on a second and twelve. Um, Michael Turner with the reception, knock him to a third and twenty, and Averill gets another sack. It's three sacks in the game. Nice game by Averill. So I get the ball back, but I'm down by three touchdowns. But Calvin Johnson, I throw it up to him, and he gets to about the twelve yard line. Man, I am talking so much, and it's kind of hurt my voice, but. On a third and ten, man, I'm in complete desperation. I got to score a touchdown. Tony Scheffler, somehow that scored, and Calvin Johnson didn't score, but it is what it is. I'm going for two, so I'll only be down by 13. And Pettigrew gets it for the two point conversion. Oh, wait, in a video game, they're going to review it, and they overturn it. So I'm now I'm down by 15 points. I have to score and get it. I got to score 15 points in two minutes, which seems impossible. But I stop them, and uh, I have all three timeouts. It's third and 12. So. Uh, hit Turner in the backfield, so it's fourth and ten. But I did not want to use my timeouts, so I'd have three if I scored again to possibly have another possession. Titus Young over the middle actually caught it that time for a first down. I'm trying to hurry up, about 20 seconds left in the game, and Titus Young over the middle and he drops it. it would have been a touchdown. I had 25 seconds left, but you know what? Oh well, because Calvin Johnson wide open touchdown. So here. I got to go for two, so I can be down by only seven with 20 seconds left, and I'll have three timeouts, so it's very possible I can get it. Nobody's open, but I see Stovall in the back of the end zone for a two-point conversion, so I'm down by seven points, three timeouts left. They get the onside kick. Stop him two straight times, eight seconds, ran off the clock, third and 11. You got to stop him again to have any word of a chance, and I hit Michael Turner. There's eight seconds left. They punt it, so I get the ball back. I have one more chance left, two seconds, to have one of the greatest comebacks ever in Madden history. Hail Mary, 80 yards will have to be the case here. Um, and I throw it up to Calvin Johnson. And oh my God, he is open behind the defense. And I freaking overthrow him. Gosh dang, it's so annoying, man. But it is what it is. I don't care. I'm still in the playoffs. That really aggravated me. And here are the stats. That's probably one of my most best offensive games of the season. I just didn't convert. Stupid plays ended up losing the game for me. Just so many stupid plays. Long passes by the Falcons. Uh, missed field goals, missed opportunities, interceptions, uh, not, not scoring points for half. That's what lost the game for me. I almost had the, one of the most insane comebacks ever. But, you know, it's all mad and stuff like that happens from time to time. So, I hope you guys enjoyed. Be sure to subscribe to my channel if you haven't already. Uh, be sure to check out my videos every week. So I upload just about every day. So, thank you guys for watching. And as always, roll tight, go socks, and go Titans to you. Have a great day.